Let's see here, Job 26 and 5. The dead. Uh, let's see, we don't want the King James. Dead things are formed from under the water and the inhabitants thereof. The spirit of the dead tremble in the water under the earth. Let's see here. The ghosts of the dead where where they're under the water along with those who live there with them. I thought that was interesting. Live there with them? How are the dead and the living living together under the waters of the earth? Let's see here. Shall giants be born from under the water and the inhabitants thereof? The next one there. Behold, <clears throat> the giants groan under the waters, and they that dwell there with them. So what is going on here? Dead things are formed from under the waters and the inhabitants thereof. You know what this reminds me of? <clears throat> the Dogons and their story of the Nomo. The Nomo, how they came from the sky and landed in the ocean. Excuse me. And how they uh, landed in the ocean. That's what that reminds me of. And how they walked out of the ocean and they made their way across the land. You know, these uh, female fish, part fish, part serpent, whatever they were. Reminds me of the first queen of Poland, right? That uh, the, the the story that they said they give honor to uh, the Little Mermaid is is done after her. Uh, this is it. They, they did these after the Queen of Poland. And it reminds me of uh, SLC 2485, right? Reminds me of Godzilla. Where does it come from, right? Look at that. So that's just, yeah, that's Job 26 and 5. What do you guys think? What does that mean? Waters under the waters. It also reminded me of when uh, Lex taught us about Phantom Island, right? That island that would emerge in the Mediterranean and the, all those uh, well, um, Caucasians would emerge and they had a year to get off that island before it would emerge again under the water. And Madame Blavatsky, right? How, but, but hers was more, um, she was looking for entryways into the earth, right? And they, they say that it's, uh, like, uh, that's why they built some of those um, pyramids um, in, uh, in, in Asia, was to cover the entryways. And then uh, if they tried to get out, they had to go through a maze, tunnels and mazes, so they would never get out. So that's what I thought about when I, when I read that. What do you guys think?